vibration a reading for uh, the Virgo Sun Moon and Rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um, thank you so much um, you Virgos and we are working with the Wonderland deck okay there is two different ones um, the Wonderland deck okay we these are the Wonderland deck the big cards and we are working also with the small cards okay this month of August as the energy vibration of your energy vibration so this month of August is going to be a fabulous month for you guys and this is wonderful because um, in the the third week at the second half of the third week um, the energies vibration change to um, your zodiac sign you Virgo so happy birthdays you Virgos um, that is born in August happy birthday okay my card just fell out so it's for someone out there eight of one information is going to be coming at speed information is going to be coming at speed for you guys um, information is going to come in at speed this card fell out so we're going to see whatever is going on information in the first week is going to be coming at speed for you guys okay all right you're working with the energy of your own energy vibration of temperance and the air fan temperance and the air fan so this is going to be a good month it's going to be a, a, a really wonderful um, calm and clearing month for you um, Virgo so let's go in and see what is going on for you Virgos okay you have the energy of uh, the three of Pentacles in reverse okay so a lot of information is coming at you three of Pentacles is in reverse not to be alarmed and then you have the energy of the ten of swords being stabbed in the back and then you have the energy of the seven of Pentacles and then you have the energy of the knight of cups okay alrighty okay so what is happening here let's see what is the message that is coming out now there's a lot of message that is coming to you a lot of information a lot of message a lot of things that is coming into you but there is no common ground with anyone okay you've been stabbed in the back and um, you are trying to build on something together with the Knight of Cups okay so as for some of you is that um, some lies especially it's going to be happening in the third week so we're going to be looking at this and see what is happening in the first week going to the second week the burden is over whatever burden you were carrying this is now over whatever lies that was being told is going to be coming out okay whatever lies that has been told is going to be coming out okay whatever the burden that you were carrying you're no more carrying this burden in the second week going in the third week the tower blows up <laughs> the tower blows up and this is fantastic do you know why this is good it's because you are working out um, some karmatic situation you're really really working out some karmatic situation because here you're seeing that there was um, you weren't getting any work uh, coming to you it could be that uh, um, if you have your own business or that sort of a thing it was blocked no work was coming into you and that sort of a thing now that is because of lies that was told okay now we're going to be looking and seeing what is happening and what has transpired what is the lies and the seven of Pentacles okay the truth is going to come out and this is good because there's a lot of truth a lot of truth a lot of breakthroughs and a lot of truths that are coming out there's a lot of breakthroughs and a lot of truths that are going to be coming out fourth week going to the fifth week because some of you are going to be um, starting something with someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion in the last week some of you um, are going to start building something this is work business that sort of a thing so let's see what is going to be happening with this uh, um, new summer work and what is um, happening um, whoever this Queen of Wands is she has been coming up in most of the reading reverse okay she has been coming up in most of the reading reverse whoever the Queen of Wands is I don't know what is happening with these um, 
um, energies these ones energies but obviously um, some of you if your father or your mother or your brother or your sister is a Pisces cancer or scorpion and your mom it's, it's it's going to be information about your mom it has something to do with your mom or someone in an organization that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay so your burdens over the tower blown up your burden is over and justice the tower is blown up the burden is over and now justice is going to come in now with the tower blown up what information came out because apparently the lies that has been told the tower is blown up so information judgment information is about to come out Aww. isn't this wonderful I'm, I'm happy for you Virgos I'm super happy for you Virgos I swear okay okay <laughs> I'm super super happy for you Virgos because I have a Virgo in my birth chart so strange but I do have I've never said this before right yes <laughs> I have Virgos in my in my birth chart okay let's see what is coming out for this judgment over this Queen of Wands what is coming out because apparently the Queen of Wands have lied whoever the Queen of Wands is she has lied yep Queen of one has lied and now Queen as one the Queen of one have lied whoever this Queen of one is whoever this lady is that is an Aries dear Sagittarius she has lied and you Virgos are going to know okay what is happening oh yeah you have win this and win this big time okay so justice come out and you have win this conflict look at you especially if you're a woman and there was a conflict in situation you stand your grounds and you use your intellect and your information and you win this conflict big times this is so so good I'm really loving your readings you Virgos you women stand up with a sword of truth in your hands and you wave it and you tell them how it is you Virgos oh my god this is so good okay ace of cups and the nine of ones why is ace of cups is coming in but you're not open up for it another big win okay I'm really loving this you Virgos you deserve this you deserve this big win I swear you Virgos you really really deserve this big win this is a big win okay this is a big win for you Virgos you come out on top so let's see what is going to be um, the um, outcomes of the month for you Virgos this is just a big win it's just a big win the ten of pentacles oh my god I rest my case oh okay Virgos and then you have the three of cups in the upright position okay I want to say congratulations to all you Virgos out there <laughs> and I've never said it right that Virgo is in my birth chart yes that's why I can get along with so many Virgos God what you have gone through it is unbelievable some of you have been going through a situation for a long time with an organization oh my god and finally 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 you have come through this and just to stand up because the lies that have been told mm, 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 mm. and 
with the lies, so many lies that I've been told. Now, finally, the truth came out. And the truth came out and it's bringing love to you because you stand up and you say exactly what is happening and you say what happened, okay? You stood up and you say what was happening and you say exactly what was happening. And here it is with the truth of sword, you know, two times yeah, with justice. But, you know, you ladies, you rock. You just stand up use the truth and you men use the sword of truth to speak the truth and I'm loving your reading the outcomes let them pay you baby let them pay you so kudos to you guys I'm so happy this is how I'm feeling inside I am so happy kudos to you guys this is a, a big win and a success um a huge win this is this is this is just a huge win um with new love coming in this is wonderful this is a huge win with new love coming in okay so that is going to be um what this month is about for you guys it's a a, a huge win huge um, win with new love coming in this is absolutely beautiful okay this is this is absolutely absolutely beautiful this is wonderful okay so let's move on and see um, we're gonna be looking at all the ages to see what is happening how it's gonna affect the general reading it's gonna affect all the people how is this general reading is gonna affect all the people we're beginning for the people 15 until 30 in general 15 until 30 for you Virgos um, you have the energy of the six of one good news victory and success is coming in Goodness. oh my god so people between the ages of um, people between the ages of 15 and 30 big news good news is coming in work ace of Pentacles ace of Pentacles for work it's the ace of Pentacles money is going to be coming in a lot of you are going to be receiving work it could be that you had a legal suit or a, um, a situation where a this um, a, something a really bad it took place okay in love the people the Virgos for the month of August 2018 in love what is going to happen for the 15 year old to 30 15 year old to 30 what is going to happen new love is coming in bravo new love is coming in wonderful 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 okay we're going to go back and we're going to look at the night of um, the people between the ages of 30 and 40 what is happening in their general life between the age of 30 and 40 what is happening in their general life they have the five of six of cups they have the six of cups um, so it's all about the family people 30 um, between 30 and 40 30 years between 30 years and 40 years um, you are going to be having some situation with the family okay if it's not your immediate family it could be your soul family you could be connecting with them you could be receiving news from a family member that you haven't heard from a long time then we're looking at work for the people between the ages of 30 and 40 work and in work you have celebration isn't this wonderful extremely wonderful in work you have a celebration that is going to be coming up so what does the Virgos between the ages of 30 and 40 for the month of August have in love what is happening what is happening in love you have to um, build on a relationship okay 
sometimes we have relationships and we expect them to just work like magic but that's not how relationships are and obviously um, there are some people out there that needs to work on their relationships some of you who are single need to start working to find someone if you are looking for a relationship okay um, some people are always saying yeah but I am um, um, where am I going to meet people go out you know go out walk in the city or something like that okay um, <laughs> I'm not I'm no longer in Europe so we have to drive to the city some places New York you walk to the city connect with people go out even to a club stand there you know to connect um, I, I just don't like the internet dating sites but if it's that your thing go do it okay let's look what is happening for the latest over 40 uh, good news is coming in for the latest over 40 in general so the latest over 40 there is going to be good news coming in okay Ace of Wands, positive, passionate news could be about um, good news coming in about family for the latest um, over 40. Good news coming in for the family for the latest over 40. Okay, what's happening for the latest over 40 would work for you, Virgos? Work, you have six of pentacles help is going to be coming in help is going to be coming in so you ladies um that is looking for work or extra work or that so, um, sort of a thing help is going to be coming in help is really really going to be coming in for you ladies over 40 okay help is going to be coming in all right let's see what you ladies over 40 have for love you virgos over 40 Ladies, love the moon. The moon. Okay. Whenever the energy of the moon comes up, especially when it has to do with love, it has to do with deceptiveness, deceptive in your relationship. There's no honesty in your relationship. There's a form of deceptiveness in your relationship. Okay. People are sitting and planning. Don't trust. If you're not trusting someone in your relationship, it's, it's a reason why you're not trusting them. Okay. Because they're sitting and planning, but it's not going to work. Okay. <sighs> There's a saying that men plan and God wipe out. Okay, whenever people are devious, hmm, men, um, <laughs> it's not happening. It's not happening. Okay, all right, let's see what is happening now for the men over 40, you Virgos over 40. Eight of Wands. Um, this is positive because the first week you're going to be receiving a lot of messages. The men. Um, over 40 in the first week you're going to be receiving a lot of message um, it can be um, a lot of message um, it can be that your burden is over or it can be that um, um, whatever the working situation is so it's not going to be happening okay so let's see what is happening three of one some of you at work is going to decide um, to move away from what you're doing some of you at work is going to decide to move away from what you are doing okay some of you at work is going to be moving away from what you're doing you're going to decide that this is I want to change my career or I want to go to a new company I want to do something different okay so let's look at this and let's see what exactly is happening okay um, we have the energy of the two of pentacles some of you men are um, have to make a decision some of you men need to make a decision about a relationship and as you make the decision about the relationship you will um, basically um, figure out what is going on and you will be okay all right so this is good um, this is positive energy 
um, for what is going on it is really really positive energy okay ladies over 40 there's some deception in your relationship if you're not trusting someone that you're in a relationship with um, then don't trust them okay because there is obviously something going on um, that you're not seeing at this moment but it's going to come out so we're working with the animal spirit guide so let's see what is coming in for the Virgos in the month of August cosmic egg oh my god all right ladies and gentlemen I'm getting hold I have to take a seat this is beautiful the cosmic egg there is um, this is so beautiful the cosmic egg now it's one of the most beautiful card in this deck and oh my gosh this is so beautiful this is the only card that has a venom in up there okay it's beautiful it's this is the cosmic egg is the cosmic egg is when uh, the cosmic egg is basically when it's like crystal children who were born okay the crystal the um these are the kids okay um th these are the people who came in on this planet to good do good okay these are the people who came in on this planet to do good okay um, beautiful energy cosmic egg you have the black egg and the gold egg there's so much that you guys need to learn um, beautiful the cosmic egg and if you look at the back this is the back of the book and this is where the last thing is it has this is one of the only card that has an embryo the cosmic egg is basically um, the people who are um, uh, universal kids um, um, kids who are crystal kids uh, um, the indigo kids uh, um, crystal indigo I, I, I used to know all of these out my head but and the intergalactican kids they also come as a cosmic egg okay cosmic egg completion harmony the infinity within the the finity the cosmic egg is the final card in the in the journey of the animal spirit deck and it represents the unfolding of the cosmic consciousness and this is what I was saying to um, I didn't say it to you guys in the beginning but the guides and angels have asked to me um, to start working with the animal spirit guides and also to start showing you guys the um, the pictures of the card because it awakes in your consciousness and here it is it says unfolding of the conscious the cosmic conscious because it's as if we do the readings the people who makes the tarot card and that sort of a thing they get the information and we have the channel information by using these cards as a tool okay the state emerge after we have tread the path for quite some times and through self-effort and grace we experience self-realization a sense of contentment and oneness spontaneous arise within us and the veils of our self limited beliefs are lifted when the essence of the egg the cosmic egg has not been activated we may feel as if we will never get there or that we travel alone disconnected from others even if our encounter with this card is a brief appearing as a monetary glimpse of flashes of the inner connectionness it um, pertain energies that stay within us the cosmic egg is the readiness for 
the refugees from all the refuge of modern day life it's thoroughly the power of the card that we are reminded of the cosmic connection written at the beginning that's powerful don't know about you but that hit me <laughs> so I love you Virgos and that's why I love you so much because I also have a Virgo in my Sun Moon and Rising sign I got Virgos um I love this lipstick it's kind of weird but that's me so ladies and gentlemen thank you for being here I will catch up with you guys next month it's gonna be a fabulous month okay I think I should rename it fabulous <laughs> fabulous month so um, enjoy. Namaste.